Central College Under Armour Invitational here with 197 pound champion Matt Siebold. Matt, during that match, your opponent is taller than you and he's stronger than you are. But somehow you're able to get past both of those disadvantages and you score, I think I believe saw six takedowns during the match. How'd you get past his strength and his height? Um, I'd say the biggest thing is I just kept going. I kept working my pace, you know. It's my last year here in college at all, so I mean I'm just going out and I'm having fun and I'm making making the battles fun. I'm make just you know doing my thing, just trying to. And I wanted to comment on that. Yeah. I saw during the match you were smiling before the match was even done. Yeah. You were having a blast yeah. out there. Yeah. What, what's your advice to to the younger classmen out there, the freshmen, the sophomores? They're not having yeah. fun right now. What what do they do? To, what do they need to do to make it fun? I mean, it's it's not always fun. Wrestling will beat you down. It'll it'll bang you up. But I mean, you just keep working. You just keep grinding and I mean one day you know you'll get in my position where I've been through uh, a division one program and I transferred and now I'm uh, in a division three program and I'm just doing it because I like it and I'm, I'm having fun you know that's the that's the biggest thing that I think I can say to younger guys is just go out and have fun I mean you, you only got four years you're not going to wrestle for the rest of your life so I mean embrace it while you can. Now you were an All-American two years ago as a sophomore you barely missed on that last year as a junior what do you need to do to get back on that award stand? Yeah, I, uh, yeah, I'd say my junior year, it was mostly in my head, you know. I wasn't, I was too caught up in the rankings. I was caught up in, oh, this kid wrestled this kid to a one-point match. This kid could potentially beat me. And now I'm just going out. And, I mean, it doesn't really matter. I mean, you just go out, rankings don't mean anything, you know. I can have the toughest kid in the country tomorrow, and I'm just going to go out and have fun and battle as hard as I can. So We love watching you wrestle. Best of luck the rest of the season. Thanks, you too. Oh, yeah.